Ja. Done this. Done this. No beast, demons, or dragons. Pog. I'm trying to go um, Murlocs. I really like Jandis Murlocs. It feels really strong, but you do need the token to start with. Is Jandis S tier? Um, with both tokens, she's really, really strong because you pretty much guaranteed two triples. Um, but yeah. Nice. And we've done it. You'd love to see that. Myers Brig is in his joke. It actually. I think a lot of these tests are really cool because it explains a lot of how people are and why people are the way they are. I think one of the most eye opening tests that I've taken and learned about is like the love language test. There are five, is it five different love languages? And they are like physical touch, um, gifts acts of service, um, words of affirmation, and quality time. I think those are the ones. And I think it's it's really important to know what your love language is and what love language you like giving as well. And it's, it's important because um, you need to know, um, for example, like, if you really enjoy acts of services but you do not care for gifts and your loved one, their love language is giving gifts. <laughs> it's not gonna connect because if they go out of their way to get you something really nice, really thoughtful, and you're just like, okay, cool, <laughs> you know, like. But it, to them, it's like, it's like a really big deal. So they're they're trying their best the momentum, to be loving to you. But you might not interpret that in a good way because you're like, oh, I don't really care about this. Right, like for me, acts of service is my love language. So when someone goes out of the way to do something for me, um, I always remember it. Yeah, it's different for everyone. Yeah, I mean, I think all love languages are valid, you know? But, uh, yeah, but it's important to know what you like and what your partner likes. Because a lot of times, people have good intentions and they just get lost. I'm a big words of affirmation dude. Becca's an affirmation. She That's her love language. And that's the one I'm the best at giving. Wait, uh, what do we do here? We could level... Level swap sell sell. Is that worth it? Yeah, I'm not playing this. If I sell sell and play it again, what's normal curve? I don't even know. I mean, I could just lock it now. I could have sold sold and played it. Oh, lucky. Really lucky there. Welcome back. How's it going out there? Can I level again? How do I get two fives? I can't get two fives. It's only turn five, you know. What if I level again? Do you guys hate it? Yeah, pirates are in. Too much greed. I kind of like it. Yeah, exactly. There's a dead person. Which makes me want to just level again. Pocky, did I fuck this up somehow? Shouldn't I be getting two triples? Not one. I must have screwed up somewhere. You swap on token? Wait, what? My god, this is disgusting. Deny him the gems! Left! Right here! I love you. 3, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11. Save me a lot of grief. Nice, I got the dead guy. Pug! Now can I just build another one? Okay, I take it, I swap it, I take it, and next turn- No, I'm just gonna do it now. Okay. 
Yeah, I could triple sell and go for another one, but that's too greedy, right? I don't think I need another one. You guys really like it? You would do it? Okay. Seems kind of greedy. No, but the thing is, I have to use my entire turn on this one. You're good at this. Oh, fuck. I think it's Charlie. You tread on sacred Should I just play this? What do you guys think? Should I play this? This is better for later. Or just play it by itself. Yeah, usually you want to taunt Omega, but it's kind of weird here. Oh, I'm not dead this turn. What do you mean, yep, dead? You think this is weak? This is turn 7. You realize, you realize it's turn 7, right? Yeah, I mean Tessa's- I, I gave Tessa's for sure. Yeah, I mean, I don't think I die here. I don't even think I lose here. Yep, totally dead, guys. I give him a triple, though. Yeah, I give him a triple and a Charlie true. But I mean, what can I do? <laughs> Cannot play it. I don't think this is worth it. No, Khadgar doesn't work with Omega. I should have tried to swap one. Kind of weird to buff this stuff. I should just be leading mechs. I shouldn't be going for this crap. This is okay though. Kek. I level. Level! Mm -mm. I see it. I like it. I want it. I got it. I want it. I got it. I want it. I got it. You like them. <laughs> Harvest Golem is not just a Harvest Golem, it's a reset for my mech, and it's a mech. Right? Also, I'm getting rid of Charlie, like I don't have gems to keep this thing around. You know what I'm saying?
pretty good. Max, max, and max. Can I explain ordering? Um, sure. I want my Omega Busters to die. Strong, strong. Oh, you disconnected? Unlucky. Well, thank you. You let me level up <laughs> instead of taking a five drop. <laughs> I got to take sixes. Oof, he is strong. this. I don't need to taunt another Omega, right? Why is it good? He has one big taunted unit. Why is it good? No, it's not good. This is good. That's great. Steady hand. Yeah, I could have played around um, Zap, but yeah, Zap fucks us up, you're right. Place. 
Woohoo!